Hey there, I'm Josh Ellis, and this is Success in Seconds, a convenient little pocket mirror you can use for a quick check, make sure everything is as it should be. And I'm Shelby Skirhawk, and we've got three steps anyone can take to gain an honest self-assessment. This one comes from our own John Addison. Johnny boy. So self-assessment is an ongoing process that requires being connected to your inner voice. Use these following action steps to effectively assess yourself. Number one, develop confidence. Mm -hmm. The most successful people are the ones that can manage all of the contradictions and limitations that we all have. And insecurity, it it just stops us from conquering our inner demons and, and, and living our best selves. So confidence is the balancing act between pride and uncertainty. You're a work in progress. So check success.com. You got a lot of resources for how to develop confidence. Yeah, I think we can help you out there. Number two, talk it out. So you got to surround yourself with trusted friends and mentors who are going to be honest with you about your performance and what areas need improvement. You got to listen to them and then listen to yourself. This ability to simultaneously doubt yourself and trust yourself is really at the core of effective self-assessment. So realize that when we encounter multiple failures, our nature is to blame circumstances, other people, the universe, but also realize that you got to take a step back and ask, could it be me? And number three, make your move. Yep. You can plot out your success all you want, but at the end of the day, just plotting it and planning it is not going to make it happen. You got to get out there and go get it. You got to meet people, develop relationships. Do the work. You have to make things happen. You got to trust your self confidence, your inner gyroscope to keep you on the right course. And you got to get moving. Go do it.